Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be reviewing the third in the series of Disney Fairy Tale Collection. Sorry that it's taking me so long to review this because I actually got it last Tuesday. Uh, but things have just been crazy. But anyways, I'm reviewing it now and that is what matters. So this is the third in the series of Disney Fairy Tale Collection. Um, it is Rapunzel and Mother Gothel. And uh, if you guys like these, I did it at the Disney Store. They're probably all sold out now. Uh, but you can get them online on Wednesday. So anyways, here's their artwork for their cover of the box. I love their artwork. I think Rapunzel is gorgeous in this artwork. I love how they depicted her face. It just looks really, really pretty. And I even love Mother Gothel how she's holding the hair because, I mean, really, Mother Gothel is just obsessed with the hair. That's one reason she even likes Rapunzel. So anyways, there's the front of that box. We turn it this side. It's got a bigger picture of Mother Gothel right here. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And then back here, it just has some detail about the dolls, which is nice to read. Um, and a lot of you guys always ask about the price. These are $130, but you do get two dolls. They are limited edition, so... And then here's the picture. I would love to have this just by itself, like as an artwork to hang up. Just because I think it's gorgeous. It's probably one of the most, my most favorite Rapunzel artwork I've ever seen. That's just me personally. I just love it. Anyways, here we go. Let's move on to the dolls themselves. So they do come with this plastic. Um, it is plastic. It's like, it's already a display case and it's very, very nice. Um, especially if you're a collector and you like to keep them in the box like I do. It's already displayed. It's in a nice box. Don't worry about getting it dusty or anything like that. Um, they do come with stands, so if you do want to take them out, you can totally do that. So down here at the bottom, it does have their little Rapunzel and Mother Gothel logo. And then this is just a plastic with the design around it. Before I show you the dolls, I'm going to show you the back real quick so we can see what number they are in their line. Of course, there is their artwork. And then down here, their certificate, they are number 4,188 out of 6,000. And then there's our artwork again there on the back. So let me turn this back around and let me show you guys both of these beautiful, beautiful dolls. I actually think, um, I just don't know. I love all the ones in this series, but I really like this one because their sizes are so similar. So they don't look like they're out of, like, they don't look like they're the wrong size or anything because this is the accurate size for both of the dolls. So anyways, let's go and start here with Mother Gothel. I think I'll show you that. Look at her hair. I love her hair in this. It's just super curly and I love it. Uh, and it's really long. It goes down to, um, I actually it goes down to about her waist, like when it comes out of, out of that area. Alright, so anyways, let me turn this back around so you guys can see. It's a little bit difficult to show you guys all the awesome details in here, um, just because they are in this box. Look at her face, so I love her face. She just looks like she has something going on. She's up to no good, because hello, it's Mother Gothel. And then, just like normal, uh, she does have that large cape right there, but just like normal, they have a lot of detail. They use good fabric, lots of embroidery with these outfits. So they're very, very nice, uh, nicely detailed outfits. They're not cheap at all. Look at that. I even love how they put her little her little uh, sword right there. Or not a sword. What are those things called? Uh, I don't know. I can't think of the name of them. And then one aspect I love about these dolls is that they actually have her holding her hair. So one, it matches the artwork that's over there. See that she's matching the artwork. And then two... It's just awesome because you guys know, you know, all about Tangled, um, Mother Gothel is obsessed with her hair. So I just love that they actually had her holding her hair. So I think it's really, really super appropriate. And then of course, um, Rapunzel has super long hair. And I love how they have the tinsel on it. How it looks like it's glowing because it's like that, uh, the flower kind of makes it glow. It looks like her hair is glowing with the tinsel in it. So out of all the dolls, I think that Rapunzel... <laughs> having the tinsel in her hair makes the most sense just because it's actually like glowing. Anyways, let me show you guys a close-up of Rapunzel here. Here's her face. Very, very gorgeous face. I love Rapunzel's eyes. And then let's just take a look at the side here. So you can see her hair, of course, goes all the way down. Super, super, super long hair. Um, and then I love how she's even holding it. She's kind of like, I don't know, brushing her hair kind of right here. And then check out, I love her outfit too. Lots of embroidery on her outfit. And there's also, I don't know if you guys can tell, oh, you guys can kind of tell, but those little orange dots, those are actually like little jewels in there. So lots and lots of extra detail with these. And then her skirt has tons of embroidery, and it's like the flower in the movie. See, it looks exactly like the flower in the movie, which I think is excellent. I love that they did, they did that on the bottom of her dress because it just fits the movie so well. And there's also jewels all over that. And then, of course, I think she's just barefoot, isn't she? Because she doesn't really wear any shoes. Yeah, she's just barefoot under there. Just her bare feet. And then one thing, I let me show you guys really quick. Look at Mother Gothel. Look how long her cape is. I bet when this is taken out of the box, her cape is absolutely huge. Anyways, guys, that is the Mother Gothel and Rapunzel out of the Fairy Tale 2015 designer dolls. 
There are two more in this series. This coming Tuesday, it's actually going to be Ariel and Ursula, and then the last one will be Elsa and Hans. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this review. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.